Children in Beijing primary schools not allowed to play. Hong Kong designed Android gadget available today, and 133 U.S. dollars for a bag of French fries in Venezuela. You're watching Drive Five, and I'm Andrea Dan. Parents in Beijing are complaining that their children are not allowed to play during the 10-minute breaks between classes. In some of the stricter schools, pupils can't leave the classroom during the break unless they're going to get water or go to washroom. Concerns are raised about the mental and physical health of the children. Research from the Beijing Health Authority showed a whopping 16.7 percent of the elementary school students having poor eyesight. Also concerning is the 15.6 percent obesity rate among primary school students in 2014. That's a 2.6 percent increase from the previous year. A gadget that provides Android operating system through connecting to the computer is available on the Hong Kong market today. Remix Mini is designed and developed by Hong Kong company Jide. It's priced at 70 U.S. dollars or 540 Hong Kong dollars. The product created some buzz as it successfully raised more than 1.6 million U.S. dollars on a crowdfunding platform Kickstarter in July this year. The gadget has 16 gigabytes of storage and 2 gigabytes of RAM. Some of the trial feedback has been quite positive. In Venezuela, McDonald's French fries are finally back after 10 months, but a bag of chips is priced 133 U.S. dollars. Why are they so expensive? The Venezuelan government implemented a very high foreign exchange rate. It does so in order to keep tight currency control as the country's economy continues to be in shambles. With the exchange rate offered on the country's black market, a bag of French fries only costs about one U.S. dollar. The monetary policy has already led to a shortage of imports on everyday goods such as toilet paper, medicines, chicken, and milk. That's it for today. Comment down below if you have any thoughts, and don't forget to subscribe to Three Five YouTube channel. Have a nice weekend.